And now that you're sufficiently fed, time to lose your lunch on Hollywood Rip Ride Rocket. The first thing you'll notice about this coaster is the completely vertical ascension. Man was not meant to move in this position. There's a reason they don't let you carry anything in your pockets for this ride. So yeah, the coaster is cool enough to fool you into thinking it's the ride's main draw. But... You forgot about one little thing. It's called the music! Sure, Rock and Roller Coaster may have Aerosmith in the dark, but this has many, many, many songs, a few of which you might actually like. You can choose which song you want to play as you wind and twist all around, and you can even spend way too much money for a DVD of you riding while said song plays. So even though it looks like a normal but still fun roller coaster, I'd say it still qualifies as something awesome that we have and the West Coast doesn't. And, much like one of the many awesome things the West Coast has that we don't, there's a secret menu! They don't let you buy a DVD if you use the secret menu because... It's not, strictly speaking, legal. There's even a song or two very closely tied with certain other parks in the area. That's right, I rode this sucker listening to Rainbow Connection, bitches! For more information about the secret menu, you can visit your local internet.